welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I got my hands on a brand new product from Seed Studio, the Determiner E Series e paper display. These devices combine the power efficiency of e paper technology with wireless connectivity, making them great for smart homes, offices, and a lot more creative applications. The one I have here is the E1001 variant featuring a 7.5 inch monochrome e-paper display with 4 levels of grayscale and a resolution of 800 by 480 pixels, all neatly packed inside a durable metal enclosure. Taking a quick tour around the unit, on the top we have got 3 buttons, 2 for switching between the pages and 1 for manually refreshing the screen. On the side there is an SD card slot for storing images and a USB-C port for charging and programming. On the other side, there is an 8-pin connector with I2C support for connecting external hardware like sensors. Opening of the metal case reveals the brains behind it all, an ESP32 S3 processor. Apart from the processor, we have a temperature and humidity sensor, a coin cell holder possibly for real-time clock, a connector for a touch panel which could be an exciting future upgrade, and finally a 2000 mAh battery which on paper should keep this all running for 3 months on a full charge. I have worked with e-paper displays before and honestly, getting even a simple image or text to show up used to take quite a bit of effort and code. But this time, thanks to SenseCraft HMI, Seed Studio's new AI-powered, no-code UI design platform, things have become much easier and smarter. You can design and deploy interfaces effortlessly, turning your display into something like a digital photo frame. Or use one of the ready-made templates to keep track of your favorite stocks. Or maybe take a look at the weather forecast. There's a lot of potential here and I'm planning to explore it further over the next few weeks. If you've got any cool ideas, let me know in the comment section below. That's all for now. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like if you did and subscribe for more such content. See you in the next one.